Niger is currently facing a rapid increase in the number of meningitis cases compared to the same period last year. By mid-April, the country recorded 2,012 cases with 123 deaths, according to the World Health Organization. Vaccination was launched in early May in Yame. Amin Abubakar came with her child to get the jab. People are talking about this disease everywhere in Yame, but not everyone has the means to pay to get vaccinated. So I'd say this is a very good initiative. Just like Amina, many families were enticed by the fact that vaccination is free of charge. The vaccine used is a new one and has the advantage of protecting targets against five strains, which are the main causes of meningitis in Niger. We started with the schools on Thursday and Friday. Then on Saturday and Sunday, we moved into the neighborhoods. The population is coming and we're doing it in a calm atmosphere. Really, we haven't had any problems so far. The mobile unit teams say they have vaccinated a thousand people in the city in four days. Unlike previous vaccines, the one used is a single dose. The region of Niamey has recorded the highest number of cases so far this year, given the epidemic threshold was reached in three health districts. The Ministry of Public Health and Social Affairs filed a request to the International Coordinating Group ICG on vaccine provision to ask for operational support and to respond to the epidemic. A vaccination campaign will be conducted in all five districts of the region. The regions of Niamey, Agadez and Doso are the most affected. Vaccination is for people aged 1 to 19.